Hey, this is Mikey here, and I have a brand new After Effects, not really a tutorial, but a video showing off my new Element 3D Shadow Rig. And I'm giving this away for absolutely free because it's really cool and because it's not 100% working exactly the way I want. So that's why I'm giving it away for free. And I'm giving it away as a pay with a tweet. Now, in order to make sure people actually tweet this out, because that's what I want them to do, I want to spread the word about this new shadow rig, I am going to set it up through gumroad.com and with a price of $1, but then when you tweet it out, you'll get it for free. And that's, you know, if you see the price on there, that's why I'm doing that, is order to make sure people actually tweet this out because I want to spread the word. So let me show you how this works. What this is, is it's a text I can put any sort of text in here and let me um, move around and it's a little bit slow because there's lots of stuff going on but you can see that there's some shadows from the text now element 3d does not have shadows um, but these ones do and I've built this whole rig where all I have to do is here let me um, get to a different angle I can come, I can come into this text input, double click on it, and change it. And it swaps out my word. And all the shadows swap out as well. So let's move back to where it says Mikey. Okay, now I've got some controllers here. So if I click here on this element null, and this is where I have some different controllers. I've got the Element 3D can, um, plugin built onto here and what this does is this links to all of the other Element 3D plugins I have in this main element comp and in the shadow comp. And so it's kind of a controller so I can come in to group one is where all the text is set up onto. So I can come into here, let's go to multi object and let's go to displacement. And as it displaces, the shadows move with it. Now let's do some random rotation. But you can see all the shadows move with it. Now, on this element null, I can, I can move the object up. And the shadow gets kind of blurred out and faded away. I can rotate. And when I rotate it this way, you can see again the shadows will move along properly with it. Now let's go back into this rotation on the element and I can rotate all these individual properties and the shadow just moves with it and even after I make all my animations I can come in here change out my word and everything switches out perfectly with it okay so let's go back to the element null where the element plugin is let's set all these back to where they were let's kind of show you from the top what's going on And what I have here is, see these shadows, I can go into this element null, and I've got this back shadow slider. And as I slide this in, it makes it so the shadows are just straight on top. As I slide it out, it moves, it moves out. Now, some little quirks about this is this back shadow sliding out doesn't seem to work very well when I switch the orientation of this null. It does some weird stuff. Let me just kind of keep on rotating this. And so that's again why I'm giving it out for free is there's I've got a couple of little quirks in it that I'm still trying to work the bugs out. But all in all you can do some pretty cool stuff. So for example like this shot right here where you have the letters kind of rotating and the camera 
going in and out of focus and things like that. So just look at the uh, links in the description. You can, you can get this rig for free and all you have to do is import it. It's just an After Effects template. I built it in After Effects CC but I exported it as an After Effects CS6 template so you should be able to open it up in CS6 and above and again all you have to do is go into the text input and switch out your text if I want to switch out the what it looks like I want to go into the element comp and I can just come in here and you know switch out my colors and things like that and that will then feed into the main composition so this is my element 3d shadow rig um, tell me what you think I am going to be doing some tutorials on how I put this all together, but honestly, I'm trying to figure out how I put it all together right now as I go. So it's going to take me a while to kind of put this all together. I've got lots and lots and lots of things linking together, uh, parented and, and pick whipped, everything, in order to make this work this way. So I need to kind of go in and kind of figure, out, figure what out what I did <laughs> in order to... It was late when I put it together, and I might have had either strokes of genius or strokes of insanity either way um, I'm giving out the project file now for free just pay with a tweet and I want your feedback let me know what you think is this something useful is this something yeah I'm gonna use this now or I'm gonna wait for element version 2 to come out you know there's hints that there are gonna be shadows so um, in the meantime this is pretty cool thanks for watching